so good morning in today's lecture we'll discuss about the steps involved in catalytic process so mainly five steps involved in catalytic step the first one is ligand coordination and coordination and the second one is migratory insertion or just insertion reaction third one is nucleophilic attack on coordinating ligand the fourth one is very common that is oxidative addition reaction and the fifth one is reductive elimination now the first step in catalytic cycle is ligand coordination and coordination generally platinum with plus 2 palladium with plus 2 rhodium with 1 plus 1 iridium with plus 1 these four metal in the scale planar geometry follow 16 electron system undergo ligand coordination mean substrate coordinate to metal directly in first step that step the coordination of substrate to metal is known as what ligand coordination during this the coordination number of metal increases and its electron count also increases but when we use pro catalyst of these metal like we have this uh, rhodium hydride carbonyl phosphine complex rh h co ppc thrice which is 80 electron system this is not a catalyst this is a pro catalyst for hydro formulation of alkene this undergo uncoordination a bulky ligand ppa3 uncoordinated from this pro catalyst and produce a catalyst 16 electron system and this ligand uncoordinated here act as a lewis base but in many hydride carbonyl complex which act as a catalyst such hydride carbonyl complex during ligand uncoordination act as a uh, the uncoordinated ligand act as a lewis acid very important example hydrido carbonyl complex when undergo ligand uncoordination the uncoordinated ligand act as a lewis acid due to back bonding of carbonyl with the metal like in this case h uncoordinated act as a act as a lewis acid in the first this ligand coordination and coordination is the first most common catalytic step the second step of catalytic process is migratory insertion or just insertion reactions now for migratory insertion the important condition is that in catalyst metal surrounded by h or ch3 group and it must attach to unsaturated ligand like co cn alkene alkyne so when we use such catalyst which satisfy in which metal satisfy these two condition which one metal surrounded by h or ch3 and attached to co cn alkene alkyne then h or ch3 migrate to carbonyl carbon produce a vacant site on which substrate y inserted so we use word migratory insertion reaction like this is second example b example in which h migrate to alkene system and produce metal alkyl system so when h migrate vacant site a y substrate is in, inserted the reverse of insertion reaction is a elimination commonly beta hydro elimination reaction in many cases like we have after the migration of h we have metal alkyl group and in metal alkyl group when we have a system where beta hydrogen show a close proximity with metal and this beta hydrogen close to metal show a interaction and these interactions are strong and and its energy is generally lie between 4 to 40 kJ per mole and these interactions are known as what beta agostic interaction their bond energy is almost equivalent to normal hydrogen bond it play a very very important role these beta agostic interaction for the elimination of 
unsaturated system like in this example when h show interaction with the metal the bond form is strong and which is responsible for the elimination of unsaturated system so gostic interaction play a important role for the elimination of unsaturated system the third most important step in catalytic chemistry is a attack of nucleophile on coordinating ligand this step is common when we use metal carbonyl as a catalyst and which are base catalyzed then the base added base catalyzed homogeneous catalysis reaction where metal carbonyl act as a catalyst and their base catalyzed then this base oh negative which generally a common nucleophile attack on the carbon of carbonyl group and then elimination of co2 which produce active form of catalyst hydrido carbonyl complex which is a active form of catalyst so nucleophilic attack is a common step in catalytic chemistry but condition it generally observe when we have a metal carbonyl as a catalyst and they are base catalyzed then this nucleophilic attack is the common step in catalytic chemistry the fourth common step in catalytic chemistry is oxidative addition reaction oxidative addition reaction is very common as the name indicate oxidative mean increase in oxidation number addition increase in coordination number so in oxidative addition reaction or oxidative addition step in catalytic chemistry metal coordination in coordination number increase by 2 as well as its oxidation state increase by 2 mean both oxidation number and coordination number of metal increase by 2 generally this oxidative addition reaction shown by iridium 1 rhodium 1 palladium 2 platinum 2 when they present with their scalar planar geometry and condition for oxidative addition reaction is metal in catalyst show metal in catalyst show coordinatively unsaturation and electronically unsaturated and must contain at least two non bonding electron so that it can lose the electron easily so condition number 1 metal present with the low coordination number as well as low oxidation state then oxidation addition reactions mainly shown by d8 and d10 system generally during this uh, oxidation addition metal change from plus 2 to plus 4 where metals are palladium and platinum when metal increase their oxidation state 1 2 3 they are commonly rhodium and iridium even metal increase their oxidation state from 0 to 2 then metals are palladium platinum when metal increase their oxidation state 1 2 3 then the metal is gold and typical substrate which undergo oxidative addition reactions are hydrogen halogen halogen acid alkyl halide even unsaturated system x and y which produce metallocyclic ring the last and the most common steps in catalytic chemistry is a reductive elimination which is reverse of oxidative addition reaction mean in this case oxidation number decrease by 2 coordination number decrease by 2 like platinum with the four coordination number we have this complex uh, which show reductive elimination and produce saturated system as a by product so the five most important five most important steps in catalytic chemistry are once again quick revision number 1 ligand coordination and coordination number 2 migrative insertion 
नंबर थ्री न्यूक्लियोफिलिक अटैक ऑन कोऑर्डिनेटिंग लिगेंड नंबर फोर ऑक्सीडेटिव एडिशन रिएक्शन एंड नंबर फाइव इज ए एडक्टिव एलिमिनेशन सो वेन वी एक्सप्लेन कैटलिटिक साइकिल देन दीज फाइव स्टेप्स आर मोस्ट कॉमन इन दियर कैटलिटिक साइकल्स टू एक्सप्लेन दी कैटेलिस थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच